of that. A thing or two about ball movement, Grant. Yeah, they really do. I mean, there's a great feel that these teams play with. Two of the smartest teams in the league. They focus on sharing the basketball and keeping everyone involved. This is a matchup for the purist. Now let's take a look at Toronto's starting lineup. Ananobi and Barnes are the forwards. Then it's Pascal Siakam. Then it's Fred Van Vliet. And now it seems Siakam is in his prime. How do you see his place in the league, Grant? Well, I really like him, but he seems to be an elite second option. Not sure if you want to build an entire offense around him, but certainly has proven to be an important piece to a championship-level team. That's good from Siakam. No team has had to make more sacrifices than Toronto during the pandemic. You are right about that, B.A. I mean, they had to change their home base to Tampa. In essence, they spent an entire season on the road. It was tough for everyone, but the Raptors faced some big challenges. No good on the second, so he hits one of two. And what impresses you about Pascal Siakam is his tremendous length with an intimidating 7-3 wingspan. Now here's Halliburton. Let's it go from deep. Barnes with the rebound. Now here's Van Vliet. Pass to Ananobi. Up top, Siakam. Just five to shoot. No good that time. And Indiana will come the other way. Inside. Here's Turner. Second chance shot. And it's Toronto with a rebound. He goes up strong, but he is met with resistance. I think that surprised him a little bit. Oh, got that one up quick. Man, that length of Siakam really comes in handy on both ends, Smitty. B.A., he's tough to guard because he's able to get his shots up over most guys due to that length. And then on the defensive end, capable of guarding the post and the perimeter. And once again, off the mark by Indiana. Barnes passes to Van Vliet. Back to Barnes. Let's go with a three. Offensive rebound. And Siakam gets it to go. The motor Pascal has never stops, showing great activity on the glass to keep plays going. Siakam against Turner. Halliburton outside. Fires in the triple. Defensively, you have to stay connected to him on the perimeter. Van Vliet with it. Down low. Siakam with the slam. Assertive move by Pascal Siakam. Slamming it in before anyone can contest it. Halliburton, the pass to Turner. Over Siakam. The kick out to Walker. Here's Nimhart. No good with the triple. Toronto's gone one or two from three-point land so far. Oh, there's the alley. Oh, what a nice defensive play to disrupt the lob. About three minutes gone in the first quarter. Turner, a screen on Van Vliet to the wing, right side. Nimhart on target from range. Rock solid screen right there. The defender got completely lost. Hey, if you're not going to fight over, you're essentially giving the shooter the look he wants. <laughs> no problems knocking that one down. He's got six. Exchanging buckets from downtown. That's been a staple of tonight's game. Hey, players love competition, and the fans love it as well. Now here's Halliburton. And we're just over three and a half minutes into this first quarter. Not going to go that time. Siakam finds Van Vliet. Back to Siakam. Oh, and makes it with the kiss. Siakam's got seven. He's such a long wing player. Pascal Siakam can operate down low. 
Halliburton against Van Vliet. There's a screen by Turner. And a miss there on the triple. For Toronto, they've gone 5 of 8. Solid opening quarter for them. And Ananobi gets it to go. What a way to begin this game. Dominating at both ends of the floor. They came in prepared, focused, and really jumped on the other team early. Here's Matherin. Looking for his first basket still in this one. And so he draws the foul, headed to the line to shoot a pair. It's going to be on OG Ananobi. And one thing about Matherin, he keeps pressure on that defense. In addition to affecting the game at both ends, Matherin has already proven to be a tremendous leader. Oh, yes, he has, B.A. He's a high intangibles guy, a hard worker, really leads by example, and he's clutch. He elevates his play in big-time situations. And he drops the first. Yeah, and for the Pacers, things had gotten stale. So they bring in a new coach in Rick Carlisle, a new potential star in Tyrese Halliburton, a fresh start for this franchise. And that's good as he hits both shots. Indiana switching things up recently, going forward in a new direction. You know, B.A., change can be a good thing. Sometimes organizations can get comfortable winning 42, 44 games, losing in the first round. But the Pacers clearly want more. And you know what? I respect that. All right, guys, some stats here. The scoring breakdown for the Raptors. Well, in my opinion, the way the three has been falling for them here early on, you have to think they'll keep firing away. And also, I haven't seen a lot of resistance from the defense when it comes to limiting their points in transition. The first one falls. And Smitty, the Toronto Raptors, the lone Canadian team in the NBA, they take great pride in that. Since the Grizzlies relocated to Memphis in 2001, Canada has belonged to the Raptors. B.A., you can tell they take pride in this. They don't just represent the city of Toronto, but the entire country. So he gets them both. The length and athleticism of Pascal Siakam is special. This is why he's such a big part of this team. Now here's Halliburton. Rebound by Van Vliet. Unusual for him, just a lack of concentration. Fails to finish the play. Oh, stolen by Turner. Here's Matherin. Toronto grabs the miss. Barnes has got five rebounds tonight. Pass to Siakam. Left side, Ananobi. It's stolen. Here's Nimhart driving to the basket. What a two-way play. Just tremendous. Yeah, the steal was slick. The slam topped it off. Turning defense into offense. Every coach talks about it. Perfect example right there. Here's Ananobi. Walker pulls down the board. And that's okay. Even though you miss, you had the right guy taking the shot. Pass to Halliburton. Down to five on the shot clock. No good. Something's off about him this quarter. And it also shows you how difficult this game is. He's just a little bit off, but it can result in missing everything. Here's Ananobi. Offensive rebound. Three-pointer Van Vliet. Always a nice way to start. Makes his first one. They're not wasting any time putting their stamp on this game. What a start. Play calling has been fantastic. They've been a step ahead of the defense since the opening tip. Indiana calls timeout.
Heels checked in for Halliburton. And Toronto also making a switch. Trent's checked in. And it's Indiana's ball. 11-point game. Pass to Matherin. Now here's Turner. He's covered by Siakam. Fade away. Nice shot by Turner. And I'll tell you, Matherin's passing game has a solid foundation. Now hopefully it continues to grow here. Van Vliet, the pass to Siakam. Shoots over Turner. The shot that time not on target. So Indiana will take it the other way. Here's Matherin. And he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pair. And one thing Benedict Matherin has no shortage of is raw athleticism. Now it's just a question of him honing that physical ability to be an effective pro-level player. First free throw is good. The Raptors making a switch here. Pirtles checked in. And he can't hit the second. Walker. And finally, that one's good. It's the little plays like that that can make all the difference. Not boxing out on free throws is a killer. Trent outside. Siakam outside. Three-pointer Van Vliet. Oh, again, Toronto with a triple. Improving as a passer, Siakam showing a willingness to get it to open teammates. Turner against Pirtle. Turner passes to Heald. Turner, a screen on Ananobi. And it's Heald missing. And he almost made them regret defending him so loosely. Pass to Van Vliet. Here's Siakam. It falls for him. He's now four of seven from the field. Man, that was fast. They're already up by double digits. This has been a beatdown right here. Possibly over before it began. Here's Turner. Rebound by the Raptors. That was the best he could do. Just fade a little bit, try and get a clean look. But the defense was right on him. Come get it, come get it. Van Vliet outside. Pass to Siakam. Shoots over Walker. Walker pulls down the board. Walker's got four rebounds now. Here's Nimhart. Five points in the game. And there's the rejection. Showing signs of being a high-level defender. Ananobi can guard multiple positions and challenge shots. Some guys just understand how to generate points. He's one of them. Now here's Van Vliet. He has six. Ananobi passes to Siakam. Out left to the wing. Over Walker. And it's Siakam again missing. Indiana trailing here. Here's Nimhart. Pass to Matherin. Now here's Turner. Over Pirtle. Nice shot by Turner. And when given the chance, Turner drains that shot. The defense has to know this and defend them better. Timeout called. The Raptors. 
<laughs> and we'd all love to hear what goes on in those huddles, but we just get the snapshots. No, we're left to infer from the adjustments we see on the floor. Jackson, he's checked in for Indiana. Halliburton comes in for Nimhart. The Raptors also with a sub. Scotty Barnes is checked in for Ananobi. Indiana on D. They trail by six to the paint. Here's Siakam. Oh, nice D from Walker. And for Indiana, they're shooting 33% in the first quarter. And it's Matherin missing. This is the shot they wanted to get. Right guy, right spot, wrong result. A minute 35 left in the first. Here's Barnes. And he drops in the layup off the glass. And the Raptors lead by eight. Good work inside. Barnes showing how skilled he is close to the rim. That 2021 draft class was stacked with talent. You look at a guy like Scotty Barnes. He went fourth overall. A player any team would love to have. You know what sticks out with Barnes is his versatility on both ends of the court. B.A., let's talk about the defensive end. He is disruptive. He has a 7-3 wingspan, and he can guard one through five. Offensively, he can handle, pass, and score. The sky is the limit for Scotty Barnes, B.A. First one falls for him. Norris checked in for Indiana. Achua's checked in for Toronto. Boucher comes in for Van Vliet. Off on that one, so he goes one out of two at the line. A 2020 first-round pick. Precious Achua was traded before his second year in the league. You know what's interesting, B.A., going from Miami to Toronto in the Kyle Lowry deal. It's rare to trade a guy after his rookie year, but Precious, he had a great second year. Here's Nora. Pass to Halliburton. Now Jackson. Shot clock at five. Healed for three. They get it back. Real smooth, guys. Great job with the tip in. Those are the kind of plays on the offensive glass that can tell you a lot about a player. Now here's Barnes. Pass to Achua. Inside. Healed against Trent. And the foul called on Buddy Heald. That's his first foul. And the Pacer is making a change here. Duarte's checked in. So it's Toronto now. Leading by five. About seven seconds separating the shot and game clocks. Six on the shot clock. The three from Barnes. Sinks the tray. Barnes has got five points. Doesn't take many. Scotty Barnes, money on that three. Halliburton for three. Drops in the three. And both teams running long-range plays that are working. How often do we see this these days? Clubs answering each other from range. And so it's Pascal Siakam making highlights for the Toronto Raptors. 11 points in the quarter. He's on fire. All right, we'll get back to the action after this break. If you're just joining us, we played through one quarter in this one. And from what we've seen from the Raptors, what's your take so far? Oh, what I love was that first quarter was all about leaking out and capitalizing in transition. That's their mindset. Attack, attack, and attack some more. You're not going to beat them playing soft.
And for Indiana, they're shooting only 36% so far in this game. So for the Raptors right now, Chris Boucher out there with Achua. Then there's Gary Trent. Then there's Jakob Pertl. And it's Barnes in at the point guard position. Out of bounds. It'll be Toronto's ball. And it's time to take another look at that powerful block. Yeah, just some terrific effort there. And you know the whole team will get an energy boost off a block like that one. Toronto's gone 6 of 9 from 3-point range. Pass to Trent. And here's Boucher. Good setup. Led him to the rack perfectly for the layup. Boucher's got his first points of the game. And here's Halliburton. And stolen by Boucher. Fires from 14. And there are the Raptors with another bucket. When Boucher is on the court, it really helps your spacing. A big who can shoot the rock. Here's Nora. Achua defending. Pass to heel. Off target from three-point range. The Raptors with a lead. To the middle. Here's Achua. Nora grabs the board. A minute and a half gone in the second quarter. Jackson with a screen on Barnes. Here's Heal. Knocks it down from distance. Heal's got six points. And down in the corner, Heal looks so comfortable. I mean, that's a shot he knows he can make. Trent up top. Releases. That's in. Coming off an assist from Barnes. Great job executing the offense. That pass on time and on point. Out to the wing. Back to Halliburton. Two minutes now played in the second quarter. Here's Heald. Again, the Pacers. Good for two more. Yet yeah, no hesitation from the veteran Heald. A dangerous score in these catch-and-shoot situations. Barnes in the post. Defended by Halliburton. Barnes, no good. The Pacers have got two of three shots to go in the second. The crossover. The shot by Duarte, no good. For Toronto, they've gone three of five since the beginning of the second. Here's Trent. And he's going to the line for two. The official saw contact while he was going up. And legacies are defined in the playoffs. Game to game, what's the measure of greatness for a star player in your mind, Grant? Well, B.A., I think it's all about consistency. The great ones in this league historically bring it every night. They may have a bad game here or there, but for the most part, the energy, the effort, and the consistency is always there. And he makes a first. Sons of NBA players like Gary Trent Jr., they grow up around the game, and they have a deep understanding of basketball. Trent hits them both. Money from the stripe. He does a great job night in and night out. Here in quarter two, we've played a little over two and a half minutes now. Healed from outside. Barnes with the rebound. Barnes has got his seventh rebound of the game with that last one. Pass to Trent. Pirtle with a screen on heel. Trent, the pass to Pirtle. Stripped away. Here's Jackson, Achua defending. It's Barnes on the wing. Achua with a screen on Halliburton. The three from Barnes. Nora grabs the board. Indiana's gone one for three from downtown here in the second. And here in the second quarter of action, as we approach four minutes played, and the foul on Gary Trent. 
That's foul number two for him. Timeout called. The Pacers. Nimhart, he's checked in for Duarte. OG Ananobi's checked in for Toronto. Closing in on four minutes played here in the second quarter. Halliburton against Barnes. Oh, it's blocked by Barnes. How about the commitment on defense from Scotty Barnes? Skilled at swatting them away. Pass to Achua. Kicks it out to Ananobi. Achua with a screen. Second shot opportunity. And Ananobi lays it up and in. Ananobi's got five. Outstanding work by OG. Unbelievable versatility. And that was a tough finish. And it's hard to overstate the impact OG Ananobi has on defense, Craig. Hey, B.A., an absolute terror on the wings. I mean, he has great length, moves well. Just one of the best one-on-one -on -one perimeter defenders in the league. Nora grabs the board. For Indiana, they've got two of seven attempts to drop since the end of the first quarter. Outside for Halliburton. Knocks down the triple. Nine points in the game. How can you leave this guy that wide open? Please. That's terrible. Trent outside. Let's it fly. And he sinks that one, hitting the back of the rim on the way in. Wow, a quick shot by Gary. The defense, they had no chance. Now here's Halliburton. Nine points in the game. Pass to Nora. Jackson with it. Just five on the clock. Parked it down low that time. Got hit with the three-second call. When you're trying to cut into a lead, you can't afford that kind of mistake. You know what it is. A lack of concentration. That's a momentum killer. Siakam, he's checked in for Toronto. Fred Van Vliet comes in for Scotty Barnes. Van Vliet outside. And an Obi for three. And again, no good by Toronto. Indiana's gone two of four from the perimeter in the second so far. Here's Nimhart. He's got five. Pass to Matherin. Over Trent. And it's Matherin missing. I mean, he's trying to shoot his way out of what's becoming a prolonged cold streak. You know, to me, this is when you want to focus on creating for others. Give someone else a chance. It's called a teammate. 
He's really finding his rhythm here. I mean, smart move to keep feeding him the ball. Let him decide whether to shoot it, whether to pass it. He's your catalyst right now. Time called here. Indiana decides to talk it over. Halliburton's checked in for Indiana. Turner passes to Walker. And lead against Halliburton. Walker, a screen on Ananobi. Here's Matherin. He drops it from range. Six points for him. And such an efficient long-range shooter. Matherin could emerge as a strong 3 and D wing as early as his rookie year. Here's Siakam. And it's in after a nice bounce off the right iron. Siakam's gotten four this quarter. And just executing at a high level. I mean, taking what the defense allows and putting in the work. The reason why they've stayed aggressive and they have not let up this entire night. And at this point, I wouldn't expect them to. And there it is for him. Rock solid screen right there. The defender got completely lost. Hey, if you're not going to fight over, you're essentially giving the shooter the look he wants. Great open look there. And the Raptors lead by 11. He's heady. He's unselfish. All Van Vliet does is make winning plays. Pass to Halliburton. Walker, a screen on Van Vliet. Let's it fly. Halliburton misses. It can be a little disheartening when you do everything right and come away with nothing. And Siakam with the slam. The coaches have to love when Pascal Siakam gets in a scoring groove. He's capable of making a big impact on the scoreboard. Tipped away. Turner against Siakam. Turner passes to Halliburton. Again, the Pacers. Good for two more. Good find there by Turner. He sees an opening and swiftly feeds the ready shooter. Walker with it. Van Vliet covering. To the inside. And he slams it in one-handed. <laughs> Talk about taking advantage of the opportunity. How about the anticipation right there that led to the steal? Then he goes straight to the bucket. Great activity at both ends. Great teamwork as well. Born in Cameroon, Pascal Siakam is yet another great NBA player out of Africa. Walker, a screen on Van Vliet. Halliburton, the putback. It's good on the putback. I always love the hard work on the glass. Just great activity. Here's Van Vliet. Halliburton with some nice D. And it didn't register as an official block, but he did everything you want in disrupting that shot. You know what he did? He timed it well and did a good job of contesting without committing the foul. When you think about Turner, one of the best shot blockers in the league, who can also score at all three levels. The 
first free throw is good. Hey, every team wants a guy who can block shots, and they certainly want a guy who can hit threes. Miles Turner does both, Grant. Yes, he does, B.A. Miles has led the league in blocks multiple times. He also shot it well from the three-point range. He's just a unique skill set. It's really hard to find guys like Turner. The Pacers making a switch here. Heels checked in. Toronto's gotten seven of 12 three-point attempts to fall. Pass to Barnes. Van Vliet outside. Three-pointer off the mark. Indiana's gone three of six from outside in the second quarter. Van Vliet against Halliburton. Over Van Vliet. And the basket by Halliburton. Halliburton's got 13. The Raptors with a lead. Pass to Siakam. Now here's Van Vliet. Count it. His third and five attempts. Built to take as much punishment as you want to dish out. Fred Van Vliet not phased by physical D. And here's Halliburton. Turner, a screen on Van Vliet. Now Turner fires from deep. That's good. And Halliburton gets the assist. Halliburton's got his fourth assist in this one. Van Vliet outside from downtown. And the rebound goes to the Pacers. Turner's got five rebounds in the game. Here's Heald. Again, the Pacers. Good for two more. That's a move you won't see many guys make. Impressive stuff. Van Vliet outside. Siakam with a screen on Halliburton. Van Vliet drives. Rebounded by Halliburton. Oh, I don't believe that. He's better than that. Come on. Here's Turner. The putback. Oh, he hangs in there and cashes in on the second chance points. He really gets in perfect position for the follow. Just a terrific read. Pass to Siakam. The three is up. It's rebounded by Indiana. Turner's got his sixth rebound on the night. Here's Walker. Again, the Pacers. Good for two more. Defensively, if you let him get in rhythm, you're digging your own grave. We've got a nine-second difference between the shot clock and game clock. Siakam with it. To halt the run. And he'll draw the foul. He'll head to the line for two. And give Siakam credit for putting pressure on the defense, forcing them to get aggressive with him. First one falls for him. See Occam hits them both. 19 seconds left to play in the half. Halliburton against Van Vliet. Now here's Halliburton. Defense right on him. Walker, a screen on Van Vliet. Three-pointer, Halliburton. And again, it's Indiana with a three. Tyrese Halliburton getting it done for the Indiana Pacers. He put together 10 points in the quarter. And more NBA action on 2K Sports coming your way right after this.
second half of basketball is upon us, and we may be in for an exciting finish based on how close of a game we've seen so far. Man, what can you say? Pascal Siakam, an impressive effort here today. Yeah, he's showing off how skilled he is at attacking the defense and converting at the line. It's a part of his game that he can always tap into. There's an art to it, and he is painting the canvas tonight. We've got Miles Turner, and it's Halliburton in at the point. So that's the group out there for Indiana. Van Vliet against Halliburton. Now here's Van Vliet. Not a lot of room. Halliburton with some nice D. Turner passes to Halliburton. Here's Nimhart. Let's it go. And it's Toronto with a rebound. Pass to Van Vliet. From 15 feet away. No good on the shot. So Indiana will take it the other way. Here in this third quarter, just over a minute play. Here's Matherin, guarded by Van Vliet. Let's it go from 11. Count it. Good. Ten points for him. And you got to be right up on Matherin, especially when he's roaming around the mid-range. Van Vliet, the pass to Siakam. The rebound by Turner. The Pacers have got two of three from the floor in this third quarter. Here's Matherin. A chance to extend the lead to double digits, but it's no good. Toronto trailing. Boy, they need something to go to regain some confidence. No question. Way too many empty possessions for them. Van Vliet against Turner. Pass to Nimhart. Here's Matherin. Gets the three ball to go. And the Pacers lead by 10. He's got that guard quickness. Matherin showing off his catch and shoot ability. Van Vliet, the pass to Siakam. To stop the drought. Good on that one. Good on the second one. The Pacers have gone three of five from the field in this third quarter. Here's Matherin at an OB covering. There's the slam dunk to finish it off. Great body control allows Matherin to finish through contact. And Toronto calls time here. And as the coaches draw up their strategies, the players staying hydrated with some Gatorade. That's key to keeping them at their best all the way up to the buzzer. It really is. And every one of those players knows it. They're all making sure to stay hydrated. It's impossible to play your A game if you're not getting enough to drink especially towards the end of games when the physical toll of a long contest really starts to add up.
And now we're three minutes into this third quarter of play. And it's Van Vliet off the drive. And too long on the shot. Indiana on offense. They're on a 9-1 to one run. Turner, a screen on Barnes. Elbow shot on the way. And it's Matherin missing. The Raptors have gotten off to a rough start. Now 0 for 5 in the second. Pass to Van Vliet. Out to the right wing. And it's out of bounds. They say it was last touched by Van Vliet. And when you look at Van Vliet on the floor, you would think he gets targeted on defense. But for a player his size, he more than holds his own. Indiana on offense. They're on a 9-1 to run. Halliburton, the pass to Turner. Shoots over Siakam. It's wide right. Hits off the rim. And Van Vliet, a very solid defender at his position, Greg. Not great length, but strong as any, B.A. I mean, he has great hands to bother the ball handler and great defensive IQ that makes the most of his athleticism. He's just so hard to check. He can turn you one way, then use the spin move to make you look sad. It's deflected. Van Vliet outside. Takes the three. Here's Siakam. Uses the glass on the layup. Siakam's got five points in the quarter. Strong finish. Siakam with great balance. Able to complete the play through contact. Halliburton outside. From the top of the key. Rebound by Van Vliet. Toronto's got seven of their 16 three-point attempts to go in. It's rare for an undrafted player to make an impact, but Fred Van Vliet has earned his spot in the league. The sixth man on a title team back in 2019, and he's become an all-star. Smitty Van Vliet's become an all-star. Is he the best undrafted player in the NBA, you think? Well, B.A., Ben Wallace is the standard. A multiple-time defensive player of the year winner. Champions like Bruce Bowen and Udonis Haslam, they're right up there. But Fred Van Vliet has a chance, when it's all said and done, to be the best. Toronto trailing. Barnes passes to Ananobi. Van Vliet outside. Oh, they get a hand on it. And a bit of a battle for the ball. And the officials signal a jump ball here. And rejected. Outside Walker. Halliburton right side. Over Van Vliet. The Pacers, again, can't hit. Those are precisely the looks this team is trying to create. You know, if you get the ball to the right guy in the right spot, more often than not, you're coming away with points. That lack of defensive intensity is not going to stop a player of his caliber from scoring. Shot to win the cold streak. Nimhar, good. He's got nine. The Raptors shooting about 47%. A nice number. Out to the right wing. Picked his pocket. Halliburton against Van Vliet. Fires the three. And again, it's Indiana with a three. All right, let's take a look at the energy stats. How the hustle game has been going for the Pacers. Their activity has been at a constant level. Always around the ball. Quick hands causing a lot of steals. Also, guys, they put in maximum effort on the offensive glass. Great determination to follow shots and not giving up on the possessions.
Pirtles checked in for Pascal Siakam. Toronto's got seven of their 16 three-point attempts to go in. Van Vliet finds Ananobi. Now Barnes. Walker covering. Barnes with it. He's got seven. Off target with the free throw line, Jay. Here's Matherin, guarded by Van Vliet. And a nice finish on the layup. And now it's a nine-point Indiana lead. And Matherin is an impressive score, skilled at finding ways to convert around the rim. Halliburton against Van Vliet. Will it go? Pacers with a rebound. Walker's got rebound number 10 tonight with that last one. Pass to Halliburton. Walker, a screen on Van Vliet. Here's Halliburton. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. That one on Barnes. Everyone in the building saw the obvious contact. The ideal guard in today's NBA, Tyrese Halliburton has length at 6'5". Now he can run the offense, plus Tyrese is an excellent three-point shooter. Throw good, Halliburton. And with Halliburton, the stats show a complete guard, Grant. Yeah, I mean, think about this. 40% from deep. Halliburton's been top 10 in the league in assists. Defensively, just racking up steals. Tyrese can play the one through three. He does just about everything. Heald's checked in for Nimhart. Toronto has gone 0 for 2 from outside here in the third. Trying to find a spark here. Yes, indeed. A rough stretch offensively. They could really use a basket. And Anobi finds Pirtle. Turner with it. And it's Anobi picking him up. Turner against Anobi. Shoots from 12. Nice shot by Turner. Turner's got 11 points. And they're refusing to take a break, even with a nice lead. They just continue to attack. You have to love it. They've taken nothing for granted. You can see their plan the moment rather than the score. Toronto calls timeout. The Pacers making a switch here. Nimhart's checked in. to Barnes. Pirtle with a screen on Walker. 
Barnes passes to Pirtle. Four on the clock. That one's good. And it's Barnes with the assist. Barnes has got four assists in the game. Great recognition by Perto, slicing through the defense in these pick and roll sets. Here's Matherin. Hey, yo, yo, right here, right here. Turner against Pirtle. With the fadeaway. Turner, no good. Toronto has gone 7 for 17 from three-point range so far in this matchup. To the middle. Oh, stolen by Turner. That's tipped. And that'll be Indiana's ball as it goes out of bounds. Pacers able to keep the possession. Jackson, he's checked in for Turner. Jackson with a screen on Van Vliet. Here's Nimhart. The kick out to Walker. Back to Jackson. Clock at six. Outside heel. The three is up. Hits the trifecta. Heel's got 13 now. Here in the second half, they're really focused on stretching the floor. This was obviously a focal point coming out of the break. Look smart when the shots are going down. Siakam gets the bucket. The mid-range isn't Siakam's go-to shot, but he can adjust to make it work. Pass to Nimhart. Walker, a screen on Van Vliet. Here's Nimhart. He's got nine. Jackson, the screen. And the three off target. Toronto's gone 0 for 2 from outside here in the third. Here's Siakam. Goes up and lays it in nice and easy. Siakam's got nine points here in the second half. Physicality is no problem for Siakam. He pushes off the contact and gets it to go. No one covering. And the Pacers lead by 13. <laughs> Just incredible. I mean, he's really making it rain out there, knocking them down one after another. Yeah, the defense has allowed him to get into a rhythm from there, and he's been relentless. Here's Siakam. Doesn't go that time. Indiana's gotten 12 of their points this quarter from deep. Four of six. Pass to Walker. Now healed. Walker, a screen on Ananobi. Healed passes to Jackson. Indiana needs to get a shot off. Here's Walker. Yes! And a nice assist from Jackson. 13 points in the game. Van Vliet outside. Pass to Trent. There's the three. Walker pulls down the board. Walker's got rebound number 11. Healed against Van Vliet. He shoots. The shot by Nimhart, no good. He had it rolling and then lost it for some reason. Let's see if he can get it back while it still matters. Now here's Ananobi. Trent from long range. The rebound by Jackson. Nine seconds separating the shot clock and game clock. It's stolen by Trent. Van Vliet right side. Siakam nails the baby hook. Siakam's got 11 here in the quarter alone. Wow, he's becoming a more sophisticated scorer. Siakam beats good D with better O. Launches a three. Pirtle grabs a miss. pirtle has got his fifth rebound in this one. Here's Van Vliet. Oh, he got it up in time, but it wouldn't fall for him. And so it's Indiana in a good situation, up by 13 points to close the quarter. Well, when you win the battle of turnovers, you typically win the battle of possessions. Time for a quick break, then back to the action. And now we have a moment to reveal our State Farm assist to the game. Now, I know he's a big man, but he's got some point guard in him if he's making passes like this. Let me tell you, when you can run offense through your bigs, 
you give the defense just another thing it has to try and take away. And there have been two very different performances from these teams today as we get going in quarter number four. So for the Raptors right now, we've got Chris Boucher, Pascal Siakam out there with Jakob Pertl. Then there's Gary Trent, and it's Barnes in at the point. Trent from long range. That's in. Coming off an assist from Barnes. Love shooting it from deep. Gary Trent Jr. with solid three-point numbers. Burton goes. Oh, plenty of contact on that shot. Officials call the foul, and he'll take two free throws now. They'll pin that one on Pascal Siakam. First free throw is good. That one goes in. Two from the line that time. And for Toronto, they're shooting 47% in this one. Looking efficient. The ball's knocked loose. Here's Trent. Oh, and he brings it down with a two-handed jam. You can't teach court awareness. Barnes understands when his guys are uncovered. Halliburton for three. And it's Toronto with a rebound. Siakam outside. Fourth quarter still young. Just over a minute played. Here's Pirtle. Oh, he gets it to fall, and that makes it just a single-digit deficit. Gary Trent Jr., his teammate, was so open, he could have passed it with his eyes closed. Jackson outside. to heal five on the clock three-pointer Halliburton and no good and it's Toronto taking it the other way here's Barnes oh and Jackson with the block and it's out of bounds they say it was last touch by Jackson it's time to take a glance again at that superb block yeah good offense comes from great defense this lead is only getting stronger with plays like that Miles Turner, he's checked in for Indiana. Barnes against Halliburton. Pirtle with a screen on Halliburton. The shot by Pirtle, no good. Indiana's gone 0 for 2 from outside here in the fourth quarter. Halliburton against Barnes. Now here's Heal. He's covered closely. That shot, no good. Hurdle with some nice D. Barnes in the post. Defended by Halliburton. Barnes, it's good. Poor interior defense. If you play him soft, he's going to kill you. Time called here. Indiana decides to talk it over. There's no way coach likes this effort level. They need to refocus. It's so easy to get run over when you lose even a little edge. Look for them to come out much more aggressive.
And the Pacers making a change here. Walker's checked in. And let's swing it over to the sideline and hear from Allie. Hey, guys, during that last break, I heard Rick Carlisle as he talked with the team. He loves the pressure D. He told his guys, quote, we've got them on their heels. They're making mistakes. Do not let them get comfortable. We'll see if they can maintain their disruptive ways down the stretch. Back to you. As always, Allie, we thank you. On defense, the Raptors. A great fourth quarter, just giving up two points. And the basket by Halliburton. Not just a knockdown shooter, he does a great job of finding space for his shot. Barnes finds Boucher. Siakam against Walker. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. Using that length to attack inside, Siakam's a major challenge for any defender to stop. Drops a first. No good on the second free throw. For Indiana, they've gone one of four since the fourth quarter began. Turner passes to Halliburton. Puts up a three. Turner, no good. And you just can't afford to give up that kind of look very often. It's Barnes on the wing. Back to Siakam. Shoots over Halliburton, and it's good as he snugs it right through the net. Siakam's got 35. This is what you do when your opponent's trying to take away the three and the painted area. Here's Halliburton. Solid as a rock from 20 feet out. And the Pacers lead by eight. He can do incredible things. He can also help you win by simply being reliable. Barnes passes to Trent. That one's good, and it's Barnes with the assist. Barnes has got eight assists in the game. If you're the defense, you must read your scouting report. Gary Drent Jr. is a threat to burn you. Here's Halliburton. And there's the drive. And the foul is called. He missed it, so he's got a couple of free throws coming his way. First one falls. Dorte, he's checked in for Nimhart. The Raptors also with a sub. Van Vliet's checked in. And both free throws good for Halliburton. And so here is Toronto. Now Van Vliet. Pass to Pirtle. Trend with it. Guarded by Heald. Here's Pirtle. The shot off that time. Oh, nice D from Walker. And here's Halliburton. Turner, a screen on Van Vliet. Here's Halliburton. Pirtle grabs a miss. Pirtle's got rebound number eight now. Here's Trent. The Pacers pull it in. Walker's got rebound number 13 tonight with that one. Inside. And it's Turner that time on the assist by Heels. And the Pacers lead by 10. Smart bucket by Turner. Use your length and score it in close. To the left side wing. 
Out of bounds. It'll be Indiana's ball. So it's both teams making substitutions here. The Pacers have gotten three of eight shot attempts to find the net here in the fourth quarter. Halliburton against Van Vliet. And here's Halliburton. Over Van Vliet. Fades away and sinks the tough shot. Halliburton's got 16 in the second half. I'm not sure if he was trying to show off or what. But when you're that open, you've got to go straight to the basket. The fadeaway was clearly a bad choice. And the Raptors miss again. Indiana's gone only one of four from the perimeter here in this fourth quarter. Pass to Matherin. Halliburton on the wing. Guarded by Van Vliet. And the basket by Halliburton. Like a matador. Olay! There was no defense. That has to be one of the easier shots I've seen tonight. And this is what happens when you start to break your opponent's spirit. The resistance is no longer there. Picked by Pirtle. Siakam. And a foul called on the way up. So he'll take two from the free throw line. Free throw, no good. And he sinks the second. The Pacers have got five out of ten shots to drop here in the final quarter. Pass to Halliburton. Walker, a screen on Van Vliet. Halliburton, the pass to Walker. Oh, he remains perfect. Seven for seven, showing no signs of letting up. They're really dictating the tempo on both ends of the court. You love it. This has been an impressive performance tonight. Even with a big lead, they've maintained their focus. Pacers on D. The baseline, J. And Ananobi gets it to go. Nice shot, OG Ananobi showing confidence. Should be a big part of this offense for years to come. Outside Walker launches it. Down it goes. And a great assist by Halliburton. Walker's got nine points now in the second half. Pass to Siakam. Back to Van Vliet. Let's the three fly. Rebounded by Heald. Just enough of a shot contest to bother him. To the paint is Matherin. And he takes the fantastic lead pass up strong for the slam. Yeah, this is how impactful Matherin can be in close. He loves jamming it home. Here's Siakam. It's rebounded by Indiana. Walker's Indiana has got two of five threes to go here in the fourth. And here's Turner from the arc. And again, it's Indiana with a three. And this is today's NBA. Big men like Turner spacing the floor with great outside shooting. Van Vliet against Halliburton. Pass to Siakam. Knocked away. Here's Ananobi looking to end the run. Kicks it out to Barnes. Ananobi on the wing. Four on the clock. Let's it go from deep. Sinks it from distance. 
And as OG develops the rest of his skill set, this is one thing he can rely upon, that three-point shot. Walker, a screen on Van Vliet. Halliburton finds Walker. And there's the call on Scotty Barnes. That'll get him his fourth foul of the game. Doubled by Siakam. Halliburton, the pass to Turner. Walker with it. Just five to shoot. Halliburton outside. The three. That one no good. And it's the Raptors taking it the other way. Barnes passes to Ananobi. Halliburton against Van Vliet. To the left wing. Siakam left side. Over Turner. Siakam no good. It can be tough to find space in the mid-range area. Probably should have passed that one up. Now here's Halliburton. Pass to Matherin. Beyond the arc. Pure from three-point range. He's got 22. And right now, Matherin is on a roll. This young guy continues to do whatever he wants. Outside Barnes. And here's Ananobi. Guarded by Heald. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. That one on Heald. Though he's still polishing the skill set, Ananobi has the size and versatility that every team wants out of his wings. free throw and the second free throw is good and trying to cut into this deficit, tough to leave any points on the table. Indiana has gone four of eight from three-point land during the fourth. Halliburton, the pass to Turner. Off target with the three. Yeah, and the defense has really got to tighten up on him. I mean, he's just too dangerous from the three-point line. See Ockham against Turner. And he was fouled while in the act of shooting, so he'll take two free throws. Well, that was clearly a foul. That free throw misses. And he's good on the second. A minute and a half left in the fourth quarter. It looks like it'll be a big win for them here. Time to just cruise to the end of the game and chalk up the victory for the Pacers. They never gave up when they were down earlier. Forced their way back into this game. And look at them now. And this one was all about desire. The perseverance of never doubting your teammates or the game plan. I mean, I love what they did here tonight. And one of the league's superstars. Producing as he always does. What a terrific game for Tyrese Halliburton. It's hard to think of a part of the game where he didn't play a major role mentally, physically. I mean, he showed us what he's capable of when he's feeling his best. And he makes both free throws. 119 left in the game. 
Hey, watch Fred. Van Vliet outside. Outside Ananobi. Siakam right side. Shoots over Walker. They get it back. No good off the glass. Indiana's gone four of nine from three-point range in the fourth. Turner, a screen on Van Vliet. Three-pointer, Halliburton. That one is off. Now Toronto takes it the other way. Van Vliet with it. Pass to Siakam. Shoots over Turner, and Siakam gets it to go. Siakam's got 39. Boy, this could snowball if they continue to put up points. I can't say enough about their performance. Here's Halliburton. Soft touch off the glass. <laughs> this has to feel good. They gave their fans a show and secured the W. They're going to win by a nice margin. The effort was there all night. Siakam, no good. There's 18 seconds left in the final quarter. Van Vliet against Halliburton. Pass to heel. Over to the left wing. And so it's the Pacers taking care of business in this one. They didn't have too many problems tonight. They didn't. Just a tremendous team effort. Once they had that big lead, they were not going to let the visitors back into the game. And that's going to do it tonight, folks, for our broadcast. For Steve Smith, Allie LaForce, and Grant Hill, this is Brian Anderson. Thanks for being with us. Now it's time to present our New Balance player of the game, Tyrese Halliburton.